Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Sarah Starr. Thank you so much for being here. So you guys, I wanna go ahead and show you what I ended up getting at Dollar Tree. Um, it's not a huge, huge haul. Um, I actually forgot to get a couple things that when I watched back my uh, walkthrough video, I was like, I totally forgot this, this, and this. And so what happened was, is after I was done doing my walkthrough filming at the store, um, I actually was trying to get to the grocery store before it was dark outside. Like it was getting to be like dusk. It was like, you know, cause daylight savings, we have more time, you know, it's like now it was like, it's like pretty much dark at like 7.30. So I was like literally trying to um, grab everything I could remember, you know, and, um, then run over to the grocery store and head home because I don't want to walk in the parking lot when it's dark, you know? So I ended up missing a couple things that I wanted to get. So anyways, I was like, oh my gosh, that's why I shouldn't shop when I'm in a hurry. Um, I try not to do that usually, and I'm not, usually not in a hurry, but in this case, I was trying to, to um, race the clock because it was going to be dark outside. So when I go back, hopefully those items are still going to be there. Like I really wanted to get that ruffled looking um, rabbit, um, you know, bunny rabbit, uh, uh, like bowl thing, you know, like for chips and dip or like, you know, for like just it's really cute. I, it was in the first aisle when I walked in It had they had it in a carrots, not in my store, but I've seen it at another store or not. The, sorry, I go to a couple Dollar Trees, but uh, Dollar Tree, the further away, had the um, little carrots all over it and the ruffled uh, little like um, can, it's like a bowl thing. I, I know you guys know what I'm talking about, but the bunny rabbit one was just super, super duper cute. And I just didn't get it. So, cause I forgot. So let me go ahead and start with this haul. Now I'll show you what I got. Like I said, it's a tiny haul, but I still want to show you what I have because I'm going to keep going back to Dollar Tree. And, um, I kind of like to do my hauls as I go to the stores, you know what I mean? So next time I go to Dollar Tree, um, I, I, prefer to just um, do them separate for separate visits because yeah, that's just how I keep myself, um, like I don't, so I keep track of what I end up getting. Like I just like to do it and then I can put this away and then when I go, then anyway, you guys, I know I'm rambling. I'm so sorry, but let's keep going. You guys with guys with this haul. This is so, um, this is some really cute things in here. So I ended up getting, let's start with the carpets. I know this is kind of like boring you guys, but I really like getting these. Um, so I just grabbed two of them. Again, I actually didn't even grab a cart when I was grabbing the stuff to buy. I just I was holding this in my hand. So that was another problem. <laughs> it's like, I didn't have room. I was running out of room to hold things. So anyways, um, I ended up getting the, um, just two carpets. These are kind of like carpet remnants or carpet squares, but, um, I really do like these. And so I just grabbed two. Now, the next thing I got was these Easter. These are so cute. You guys, these are the foam shape 13 piece, um, Easter bunny, uh, little, craft to do. So what it has is it has just one little bunny in there, but you know, I ended up picking up four because I thought this would be really cute for each of my kids to decorate. I have four kids and then they can put this like in their room or on their bedroom door, like to, you know, part of Easter decorations. Um, it's just really fun and just kind of make it your own little Easter bunny. So it even has an Easter, or sorry, it has a little carrot you can put in his hand um, or her hand. She's just really, really cute. So I ended up getting four of those. This is by Green Briar. It does add up, you guys. Now that everything's $1.25 there, it adds up really quickly. But I still think if I were to try to go buy all these little pieces and try to do it myself, it would be way more than $1.25 per item. You know what I mean? So I can't complain there at all. So I'm really happy I found these. I still have to go through all my Easter. You guys, I have a ton of Easter decorations I need to go through. I'm going to start decorating for Easter, um, I think, in the next day or two. So anyways let me go ahead and get started I mean I still already started you know decorating my studio here but the rest of my house I'm going to start really putting my Easter decorations out okay so that I'm excited about and then the next item I picked up was this chalk um, so I'm actually going to be going to five below soon because they do have some really cool chalk sets I hope they still have their fingers crossed um, the last time I was there was about a week and a half ago I did a walkthrough video on that I might do, include that in the back of this video but they did have like I don't know if I showed it in the walkthrough video there though but they do have chalk sets or they did have chalk sets uh, so hopefully they do have them when I go um, but they're five dollars and you get a ton of chalk this here is a dollar 25 for three pieces but my daughter wanted some chalk so I went ahead and just picked this up that's all they had at my store 
that I could find for chalk. Usually you can find them in the buckets, but I haven't found them. Um, so this is kind of fun because it's a sidewalk chalk with holder. So it, it's kind of got like, you don't have to touch the chalk and get your hands with chalk on it. It's kind of a cool little tool to like, you know, you could probably just make circles or whatever, you know, art on the um, concrete. Um, and so I did get just one of those. All right, then I picked up this. So, this is really fun. This is outdoor fun. <laughs> That's fun. I said, funny. I said, this is really fun. It says outdoor fun bug catching kit. So I thought this is really cute. If we catch any little ladybugs or anything like that, I'm going to release them. Absolutely. I would not keep them in here. Um, but they're just really cute because you can kind of see there should be a magnifying glass. You know what? This one does not. Okay. That was a difference. Oh, it does. It surely does. It has a magnifying glass up at the top right here like a little viewfinder, if you will, right here. And then it has a little um, place for the bug to, to breathe. And, uh, but, oh, and little like tweezers down there. So yeah, this is actually, I think a better setup than, there's two options. So there's some tweezers inside and it has a little thing to um, scoop up the little critter, but um, the little insect, but it is, um, they had one more that was just like a tiny little tube and like a little tweezer set, and I, like a little magnifying glass. I feel like you get a lot more in this kit versus the other one. So I got one of those. Then I ended up getting these slippers, you guys. So um, I love these slippers. What I have found with the ones that are folded like this, you know, the ones that don't have any words on them, every time I buy them, they're either all, they're both left foot or both a right foot. I don't know what is going on. Cause I bought some for when we went to Las Vegas and then I just tossed them because um, I wear them around the hotel room because I don't want to touch <laughs> my feet. I don't want my feet to touch the carpet at any hotel floor, like ever. So I always buy just like, I call them these disposable, um, for when I travel, but these are also really nice for around the house. You know what I mean? And for a dollar twenty-five, I cannot cannot go wrong. And I would have bought more of them, but some of them look kind of dirty. I'm like not even gonna like, ex so, yeah. So I would have bought more because these are so stinking cute, you guys. It says sweater weather. I mean, these are really cute, and I think these would be really cute in a gift basket. But these are gonna go with me on my girl trip with my mom and sister coming up. I'm gonna take these for the hotel room, so I have another pair of. Uh, you know, new slippers that aren't lefty or right. It was kind of hard to walk around, you guys, with two left feet, or was it two left feet or two right feet? Whatever they gave me, whatever it came with um, in my, on my Vegas trip, just try to imagine that. You, you get a good laugh if you can imagine me trying to walk around with two left feet or two right feet. So, but I made it, I made it work because I'm like, I don't want to touch the carpet floor, um, at, like I said, at any hotel. So, anyways, you guys, but um, they had one other option. I forget what it was. It was a white slipper and it said something else on the, it's also included in my walkthrough video. If you want to see that, I'll probably put that in the back of this video. So anyways, and I love the blue. So, and they all have different sizes and everything. I chose the size large and the large is for an eight to nine. I would have got an extra large, but they didn't have it in an extra large. An extra large is a nine and a half to 10 and a half shoe size. Okay, moving on. I ended up getting, I found only one pair of like the new Ioni 3D um, lashes. These are so gorgeous, you guys. I love Ioni lashes so much. Um, and this one is called, what is this one called? This one's called Voluminous, okay, I can't say that word, Voluminous Doll. So you guys, I really, I'm wearing Ioni lashes right now too from Dollar Tree, but I really do love these lashes. And these are um, by... So I think this collection is called Daint Tree, D-A-I-N-T-R-E-E, -E. um, but you're really cute. I love the packaging. It has this like cheetah print on it. And then the back has, it says electric jungle, but I like my eyelashes super duper, 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 oops, duper long, you guys, like really long. So there we have those. Okay. Then I ended up getting a good old fashioned thermometer. Um, I always like just having these extra ones around. So this is a really good value for $1.25. Um, and then this is the 60 second digital, um, thermometer, high accuracy and fast response, easy to read digital display, uh, peak hold and auto shut off functions. Um, so yeah, I thought that was really nice. We also have the like, uh, one that you can put on the forehead that wasn't from Dollar Tree, but I kind of like the good old fashioned thermometers better. I don't know. I just kind of prefer them. Okay. Then I also picked up one of these tablet cutters. I thought this would be great to have in my medicine cabinet. And then 
I also picked up these for my kids' Easter basket. I thought this would be really fun. These are space sabers, space, not savers, but like space sabers, S-A-B-E-R-S. They're little like inflatable um, space savers. So they're supposed to, I think, self-inflate. Yeah, they self-inflate is what it said on the box there at the store. Collect them all, um, one piece, and uh, yeah, I think they you open it up and it actually has glitter on the ball, like gold glitter. And I think it's I think the box said it self-inflates. So I'm excited to try this. It's um, by Orb, the company Orb, which is you know a well-known brand there. So yeah, I ended up getting there's one one of them, and I got a total of four because I have four kiddos. So I thought, and the, you know, this would be cute inside an Easter egg inside the Easter basket. So I definitely wanted to grab those before these sell out because I think it's just a fun, fun item, like novelty item. And how cool is that to see to like self inflate? Um, yeah, so there we have those. All right, moving on. Let me see what else I want to show you. Okay. Oh, okay. I had to get these. I got them in all the colors, you guys. I'm like, I don't, sorry, there's like dust that just flew out of my back. I, these are so darn cute, you guys. I can't get over how cute these are. They just remind me of like, just, I don't know, they're like very shabby chic. Like even as like, I don't know, I just like want to decorate with, I mean, I know this is not a decorative item, but it's so cute. It's embroider, embroidery needle, called a needle bundle. So um, I ended up getting, I got all, like I said, all the colors. I'm going to go ahead and show you how cute this is. I'm going to gift, I'll show you one I don't think I'm going to gift because I, I'll show you all three and then I'm going to open it up and show you. But here's the pattern on this one. Isn't that so precious? So there's that one. There's also the blue one. I think it's so cute. The polka dots are so adorable. I love this one. And then I'll go ahead and open this one, the pink one. Isn't that so cute? So again, you know, for sewing or um, fixing a button and you need to put your pin in there. I mean, it is just so cute, you guys. I have bought one of these for my daughter on Amazon. And it was like eight or nine dollars. And so for $1.25, it's just a great deal. Let me show you. It kind of reminds me of like a corsage because you know the corsage you put on your arm with a little elastic thing there. This is so cute. It's got like a little button over there. It's so cute. So let me go ahead and show you. It's like squishy because of course you want to put your pins in there. And the back is like um, a hard surface. Let me go ahead and show you what it looks like on. Yep, there you go. So it's perfect for like doing any type of alterations. You have your little um, bundle. It's called a bundle, right? Yeah, it's called the embroidery needle bundle. So there is that. <laughs> Anyways, you guys. So um, it kind of, it's so cute. I think these are so cute. And I don't sew, you guys, but I was like, I have to have these. They're just so cute. So, but my daughter does sew. So I will go ahead and give her, I think I'm gonna put two of these in her Easter basket. I'm like, why not? She, they're just really cute. Okay. The last item I'm so excited about is I got this. This is so cute, you guys. What? Isn't that so cute? It's the enameled, right? It has like a, um, it has a, what, how do I want to explain this design style? It kind of reminds me of like something you would see in Paris. Like it's just kind of like vintage looking. Um, and I love the font on it. It says Flower Market Established 1953. And it's on both sides. It has like the weathered look to it. I love the white enameled with the black. It's so sharp looking. It looks so nice. They had it a taller and like a thinner one. And I almost bought it, but I have so many vases. I don't need them. But I do have a plant that um, is in my kitchen that's in a uh, kind of a boring planter, you know, thing here. So I'm going to go ahead and put it in here. And it'll like just kind of like make it a little look a little richer I just think this looks so nice you guys and it just is so cute so really happy to have found that there's not a ton left of these so I think this is one of those things that go really quick anyway it'd be great for like if you give somebody a plant like you know you could put it inside here and then gift it it's like kind of like an extra little thing to a uh, gift like a housewarming gift or that type of thing so anyways you guys yes so that is everything for this haul I know it's like a short teeny tiny haul but I did want to show you what I got. So um, anyways, you guys, thank you so much for joining me. I would love to hear what your favorite thing is I picked up on this haul. And um, I really do appreciate you guys being here. And if you're new to my channel, I would love if you would subscribe. 
my returning family, you guys know I love you so much. I appreciate each and every single one of you so very much. Thank you for always being here. And with that being said, I'm gonna close this video, but I will see you guys all very, very soon with my next talk. So till next time, everybody, take care. God bless. I'll see you soon, friends. Bye for now.